Before I start writing, I always know the uh, beginning and the end. And I'll, I might know four or five plot twists. I know the generalities about the characters, their age, uh, you know, maybe a little bit about their background, their family situation. Hi, my name is Nicholas Sparks, and I am the author of The Longest Ride. People sum me up in a word. They might say, hey, you know, he writes, his books are, have a lot of romantic elements. Or, oh, he's the guy who always writes those sad endings, right? Real black and white. But the thing is, you know, those romantic things don't work, or those sad things won't work, unless you really evoke everything else. Um, betrayal, loss, confusion, honesty, uh, integrity, uncertainty. And you have to get all of those to make these two work. I think people have this, I perhaps have this idea that authors wake up with a fully fleshed, thought out, nuanced plot. But it's not like that. It really is the seed of this idea. So the seeds have come from a lot of different places in the past. They've been uh, family events, sometimes uh, a character, a person that I know might inspire a character. Sometimes it's a voice or a theme. Sometimes it's an image. To have an idea that uh, will work equally well as both a novel and as a film is a very high bar to reach. The smallest idea can stump you. It worked, would work great in the novel. And you get here and it's like, this just isn't gonna work. There's too much introspection. I can't film introspection. It's not going to work. And so the, the seed will wither and die. However, the moment I start writing, the moment I have the story that I think will work, from that point on, literally from word one, it's only about the novel. I don't think about the film at all until really after I'm done with it. 